Welcome to American Broadcasting Station. With just one simple click, kindly subscribe to our channel for more updates. Russia wants the West to ease restrictions on its state agriculture lender Roselka's Bank to facilitate Russian grain exports. This request was made during talks to extend the deal on food shipments from Ukraine. Moscow suspended its participation in the secure Black Sea Grain Corridor in late October, but rejoined after four days, easing fears of further disruptions to grain exports from key supplier Ukraine at a time of rampant global food inflation. President Vladimir Putin has reserved Russia's right to halt the United Nations brokered agreement again, while UN Chief Antonio Guterres is pushing Moscow to agree to extend the pact beyond its scheduled expiry on November 19. Russia has not detailed its demands publicly beyond calls to unblock Russian fertilizer stuck in European ports and warehouses and resume exports of ammonia, an important ingredient in fertilizer, through a Russia-Ukraine pipeline. Russia is asking Western countries to allow state lender Roselka's bank to restore its relations with correspondent banks despite Western sanctions. This would allow the bank, which has not had a major role in the international grain trade so far, to process payments for Russian grain and other foodstuffs. Before the latest sanctions, such payments were handled by international banks and subsidiaries of other Russian banks in Switzerland. Russia has said the sanctions imposed after the start of what it calls its special military operation in Ukraine make it hard for Russian grain and fertilizer traders to process payments and access vessels, insurance and ports, even though food is exempt. Meanwhile, the UN has said it remains committed to removing the remaining obstacles to the exports of Russian food and fertilizer. Moscow has said its consent to extend the Black Sea grain deal depends on support for its own grain and fertilizer exports. Russia is a major agricultural producer and the world's largest exporter of wheat. Ukraine, whose shipments to global markets were blocked by the conflict and Russia's control of Black Sea waters until July, is one of the biggest suppliers of grains, oil seeds and vegetable oils. Russia's resumption of the deal on November 2 followed mediation from Turkey, which helped broker the agreement alongside the United Nations. Kindly subscribe for more latest news updates.